Hey, Mom. Where are you? Wait, what? So you're not coming? But I'm already here. I know, but Mom, don't we owe it to Grandpa to... Yeah, I know. It's just... What? You can't sell the clock? Grandpa's had that for years. Okay. Okay. Whatever. It's fine. I can just start clearing out my boxes and then... I don't know. We can come back tomorrow and do the rest? Yeah. Bye. I'm really going to miss you, Grandpa. All right. Let's do this. I have always loved the British countryside. <sighs> it's going to take forever to sort through all these. Grandpa sure did like his books. Maps. Lots of maps. The Hero with a Thousand Faces by Joseph Campbell. Grandpa loved reading maps and making maps. Oh, Grandma's cello. So this is where it ended up. I really wish I knew if that was in tune or not. Fairies by Brian Froud and Alan Lee. These books are all so old. Hey, wait. Is that the biography of George Lucas? Celtic Myths and Legends. This must be from Grandma and Grandpa's wedding. It's Grandpa on one of his expeditions. He sure was adventurous. Aw, it's a picture of us. Grandpa, you sweet old bastard. <sighs> it's going to take forever to sort through all these. Grandpa sure did like his books. I should see if I can find the missing pages before moving this. It's locked. Nah. Celtic myths and legends. Oh man. My old A station. I spent hours playing games on this thing. Hey, Mr. Piggles. Hello. This is... Howard James Wright with a message for my granddaughter, Sarah Elizabeth Wright. So if anyone else is listening, they can start off immediately, please. <laughs> <clears throat> Sarah, if you are listening to this, then it means... Well, it means I'm gone. But I don't want you to be too sad about it. That's just the way life goes sometimes. So, chin up, my little pixie. Remember our grand moments. All the adventures we had when you were a little one and I wasn't such a cranky old man. I, I know you have questions for me. It's true I kept secrets from you and your mother. But there were good reasons. There are things in this world greater than ourselves, and I needed to protect you from them. I didn't want either of you to face the dangers that I've had to... I never wanted to place such a burden on your shoulders, but now it, it's unavoidable. Pixie, I need your help, but I can't just tell you. I have to show you. You will need to see for yourself. This world is full of secrets. From the tallest tree to the deepest river, in every breath of wind and every dancing flame, all you have to do is look. Goodbye, Sarah. I love you very much. Goodbye, Grandpa. I am not taking this with me. It's a landscape painting of Whittington. My grandfather's grandfather clock. How much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a... Grandpa loved this thing. 
told me it was one of a kind. Although, he never actually told me why. The Hero with a Thousand Faces by Joseph Campbell A typewriter Fairies by Brian Froud and Alan Lee It's a chessboard with the game already in progress. <sighs> it's going to take forever. Whoa. This looks like it belongs in a museum. An old bicycle. Hiking by train. I'm leaving by train. It's a small, simple key. Maybe it fits the desk. That's a really nice... binocular. <laughs> Monocular? Um, a pretty fancy looking compass. An open desk drawer. Hmm, what's this? Hmm, what's this? Huh. This tin box looks fairly old, and has a combination lock on it. Okay, these can be pushed. Yeah, <laughs> I did it. This looks like, is this a second part of my necklace? Serious woe. It won't budge. It won't budge.
Was that it? Did I do it? Whoa, whoa, whoa! What's happening? No, 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 no! That was the first time I traveled by magic, pulling at the thread that would unravel my grandfather's mysteries. I so wish he told me sooner, so we could have gone on at least one adventure together. Instead, I went on his adventure, the one that never was. But that is a longer story, for another time.